What is happening, everybody? Welcome back to Final Fantasy IX. No magic run. All right. I keep my voice down. I got people sleeping next door to me, or right next to me. So, or not right next to me, but in the other room. So that's why my voice is so low. Anyways, I bought more potions because I needed them. I just went to Medane Seri, or not Medane Seri. I went to uh, Konopatai. Um, also. While doing that, I turned in all those stones and got myself a moonstone. Yeah, um, doesn't really protect, doesn't really do anything. It teaches you beast killer and shell. I guess that's cool, but yeah, other than that, it doesn't really do much. Um, yeah, I got Zidane Star on fair earrings. Um, I think everyone else has body temperature, if I'm not mistaken. So she's still working on these few things here. Uh, got, yeah, so I learned, uh, my temperature and got you. No, I don't need these anymore. I'm not gonna teach um, Echo spells at all, cause why? <laughs> um, let's see. What can I give her? Eh, let's give her a. Where was it? Eh, it was in the, the top. Ah, here it is. Yeah. Go ahead and get her started on that. Um, yeah, may as well get her started on a few other things too. Let's see. What would I, yeah, let's go ahead and get our start on locomotion. And it's on, yeah, it's good enough. Yeah, alright, cool. So yeah, Echo learns pretty quickly stuff, which is nice. Alright, yeah, let's see. Yep, need body temperature, obviously. Um, I think that's about it. Yeah, we're good here. She needs body temperature too. Uh, let's end ability up, obviously. Yeah, we're good there. I want to get everyone on the on a body temperature because we we'll be fighting a boss that does it so that uh, that inflicts burning that inflicts yeah inflicts burning so yeah um, also I think devil killer is pretty good yeah or I don't really know about that I don't really care about it I might actually give uh, is it on auto haste but we'll see anyways anyways let's move on deeper inside the tree what the hell is this thing. It's like it's a tree, but it's not. Really weird. <laughs> yeah. Um, I had to turn down. I had to turn down the uh, volume on the um, TV, but I put the speakers right in front of the camera, so hopefully, make up for it. Yeah. A stroper. Let's go ahead and run away. Nice. Ran away without doing flee. That's always good. Good stuff there. Also, position myself like right in front of the camera. So you guys can hear me a little bit better. Yeah. As far as my voices go, I don't know, man. Cause yeah, what, we'll see. Yeah. What's this? Looks old. Wonder who built it. This way. Hey, you all right? Aren't you guys scared of heights? Gosh, it looks will help us. Why don't you stay here? And let us handle the rest. No, I'm going with you guys. I have to. Don't leave my side, okay? Oh, okay, thanks. Ego, do you know anything about this place? Nope, this is my first time inside the Eiffel Tree. This place looks ancient. I don't know if I can do these voices here. Let's go ahead and try standing on it. Alright then. Sit on. I'll be fine, don't worry. Ah. Yeah, I can't do the. I can't do the Archer voice, I know that I know that much for sure. <laughs> what the hell's going on here? Here it comes again. As we that's what I skipped over. It works. I'm gonna see where it takes me. I'll call you guys over if everything's alright. I'm coming with you. Me too. M me too. Okay, we'll all go. Do need voices as best I can, people. Although I don't, I don't know how good I'm doing them, but I don't really care. Alright, yeah, it's just a straight line here, so... I think there's treasure somewhere. Nope. I was wrong. I'm always wrong on that. I don't know why. I always think there's treasure there. There is treasure, though. It's reminds me of Earthbound in uh, that one place. Oh, ho! There's treasure right there. I wonder if we can get to it. Something sticking out. Of course, what we do is push it. There we go. Beautiful. Nice. And random enemies. Lame sauce. 
That's okay, I guess. I hate recording like this, man. Well, the house is crowded now. There's nothing I can do. Got Stroper. What I don't care about. And we're gonna have to flee on this one. Don't you sweep. Oh, you bastard. God, that does so much damage, man. Jesus Christ, dude. Huh. It's insane. <clears throat> Let's run. Drop $90. I don't care. Uh, there's no save point here. Um, that save point that I was at, that's the only save point in the whole tree. So, yeah, whatever you gotta do, you gotta do it before coming here because it's. I mean, there's a. There's an enemy gauntlet coming up and a boss fight, so, yeah. Which is why I wanted to uh, get potions because I need them like crazy. And we don't have access to high potions yet, so, yeah. Speaking of. <laughs> There's one right there. Nice. Da, da, da. Here, here. Let's see. There's treasure in there, I imagine. Oh boy, oh boy. Hate them. More enemies I don't care about. Oh, a zombie dragon. Nice. This guy can use level 5 death. Um, it's pretty tough to beat. Unless you just use a phoenix down on him, or cure spells, or whatever. I'm just gonna run. He does give you 3 AP, so if you want to do AP grinding, you can do it against this guy. You eat him with Quina, he'll teach you level 5 death. So, good stuff there. Alright, who are you doing a lot of damage to? Dagger? Yeah. Um... Nothing in there yet. I don't think I can get anything in there quite yet. Hidden treasure? Ether? There's nothing in there yet. That's what I was talking about. I always think there's treasure in the places where I know there's not treasure here. <laughs> I don't know why. Just how it is, I guess. More Draco zombies I don't care about. I'm not gonna be cheap and use Phoenix down, but I don't wanna drag this fight him. If I fight him legit, he'll just drag the fight on, so I'm just gonna run. <laughs> and it'll keep my levels low too. I don't wanna be too over leveled for this run. I mean like it's easy enough, like doing it normal with using magic, so yeah, like I don't see the point in in leveling. Now be oh kind of me is food nice. That's a new upgrade for Aiko. Teaches her new spells and increases her attack a little bit. Hmm. I'm gonna keep her on the uh, molten racket because I don't care about learning magic right now. Go. Let's keep moving. This is gonna be a long ass episode because, uh, yeah. No save point, so it's gonna be probably a good 20 or so minutes. Stropers, I don't care. Oh, nice. Oh, it ran anyways. Nice. Good. I am, in, I am glad. Sucks I have to keep my voice down, man. Oh well, big deal. Come on, place soon enough. There we go. Everything up there looks withered. This place really to looks totally different. It's so bright I can't see the bottom. I guess you should try and get to the bottom of this. <laughs> on. I found something here. Hmm. Maybe it'll move like the last one. Didn't move when I got on. You stood on it? You stood on it? Well. Oh, yeah, I'll try it again. 
go. And of course, what I got on it felt I felt it respond. I guess we're in luck. Yeah, so if you need to backtrack, you can actually ride this down to the uh or ride it back up. So yeah, if you need to do that, but whatever. It sure freaked me out at first, but there's no wind or anything. I guess I have glowing powder stopping the wind somehow. You okay, Dagger? Yes. I wonder where we're going. Yeah, me too. Maybe Mark can tell us something. What do you feel here inside the Eiffel Tree? Uh oh, he seems panicked. Really? Alright, thanks. Well, what's the word? Um, Mog senses a lot of life beneath us. Mog with fairies, so they sense life everywhere. But Mog senses there's a whole lot here. wonder if agents of Kuja are down there. But what's the connection between Kuja and the mist? Incoming! Got enemies. We can't run from these guys. One of them is a Draco zombie, I think. Not a preemptive strike against zombies. Nice. I would just beat him down. I don't care who attacks what, to be quite honest. Nice shot. Oh, come on. Suck, dagger. Maybe I can get one last shot on that one from behind before he uh, turns around here. Never mind. I think you get a chance to heal in between fights, so not too worried about losing a lot of hit points in these fights. Boom. Nice shot. Made up for your last miss. Very good, Vivi. Nice. Good levels. Yeah, his enemies give up a lot of XP now, a lot of money, a lot of AP, a lot of AP. Levels are gonna be going up like crazy if you've been, uh, if you haven't been leveling. There's so many strange monsters here in the Eiffel Tree. Could it be the mist causing it? Beats me. Evil forest and garden ruin and unique monsters too. But if the must mist comes from this tree, how come it always appears on this continent? I guess there has to be something that channels the mist. Yes, but the question is why? it on. Hmm? What's the matter? VV? Let's go ahead and heal. Oh, eh, 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 one more. What's up? What's wrong, VV? You've been lost in thought for a while. Oh, it on? I've been thinking about the mist. Y you remember the factory we saw in Dolly? Yes, the factory of black mages were being made. Huh? Black mages? They look a lot like Vivi. Dagger! Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. It's okay, I'm not upset about anymore about being made and everything. Vivi. Anyways, that fact it had a lot of mist inside, right? Oh yeah, there was this huge machine filled with mist. That's right, and then there were those strange eggs we saw. There's gonna be a connection between mist, the Kuja, and the black mages. I'm so confused. Another one's head this way. And we fight more enemies. Awesome. I suppose. It's all the same, really. Here's a Draco zombie. Let's see what we fight one legitimately now. Yeah, they have the ability to turn your players into zombies. Really, really annoying. So now Echo's a zombie, meaning she'll, she has like zombie-like traits. So you gotta use a magic tag to uh, cure it. You can end this fight really easily by using a Phoenix Down on him, and then just hitting him once, or the Phoenix Down and just kill him outright. Oh, level 5 death, this might be bad. I don't know who's level 20 and who's it's... Yeah, Dagger Max. And Echo. Not Vivi though, thank god. 
Yeah, so level 5 death is pretty bad. Especially if your players are at a, I mean, if your players are at a level multiple of 5, then they're pretty much clipped. You know what? You cheated, I'm gonna cheat. Good, hit Zidon. Yeah, see what the Phoenix down did there is, is it, rec it reduced his damage, reduced his hit points to critical. And you can just hit him once and then he's done. Pretty cheap move, but I was in dire straits. So I don't care. Echo, Echo learned a bunch of stuff. It's good, I don't care. I have to do a double take of this. I'm already at 15, 16 minutes here. Hey, I can finally see the bottom. It's, it's so deep. I don't know what's going, I don't know what's down there, but we'll soon find out. Actually, I can go back to the Moogle and then save there, which I'm probably going to do. Yeah, in fact, I am going to do that. Come with me. You're going to make a helpless little girl like me go all by herself? Wait, there might be monsters lurking down there. Says it on. Mox sends life down here. Do you sense anything? Yeah, but you sense it too, don't you? We don't even need Mog to tell us that there's life down there. Or down here. You're right. I can tell there's something down here. Giant harp. Hm. That's what it looks like to me, anyways. It always looks like a harp to me. Like the harp of, like, mist. Alright, so now we get to... Heal. See, Mario had 60 potions. It's crazy. Um, I think, yeah. So we can get on, we can get on this, and it will take us back. Let's go back up for now. Yeah. So this takes you back up to where you were before, where you can save and stuff, and get more and buy more stuff. You got a lot of second chances here, but yeah, I'm gonna, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go back up, uh, up climb up, climb back up the tree, save. And then we'll uh, see what's down here. See what's down in the depths of the Eiffel Tree. We'll do that next time on Fall Fantasy Nine. No magic run. Sorry about my me keeping my voice down. Just that's the way it's gonna have to be for a while. Um, yeah. So turn. I guess turn your speakers up. That's the only thing I can really say. And hopefully I'll be able to do voices and stuff again. But I don't know. I mean, eh, whatever. Anyways. Uh, yeah. All right. Peace.